Happy Thanksgiving, guys. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. And welcome to day 22 of our free eight figure club coaching and click funnel support. Guys, I'm excited about what we're going to be talking about today, which is what I call the stealth bomber strategy. Okay, now we're going to get into that, into that in a minute. But for all of you who are watching today, thank you for tuning in. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in with me live. Uh, this morning. I'm excited to be here today. I'm excited for what I have to share uh, from a high level. Okay, a stealth bomber flies at about 50,000 feet or so I'm told. I've never personally flown in a stealth bomber, but many times in my business, I feel like I'm flying at that stealth bomber level, looking down over the over um, even the planes. The planes fly at about 30,000 feet up and then you got everyone else down there on the ground walking, driving, driving, by, you know, training it, and um, you got everyone down there below. So it's really important, guys, that you understand what it takes to generate a million dollars a year or a million dollars a month in your business and get into the Two Comma Club Awards. So I'm gonna be sharing behind the scenes of what I do with every single person, every single company, every single business that comes in to invest a one day with my team and I to create the strategy, the overarching strategy of how to blow past the two comma club. Okay, let's get you into the two comma club, but then let's blow past it and get you on your path to generating eight figures and get into the eight figure club award uh, so you can impact more people, right? It's not about the, what the money can do or what the money can make, it's about what the money can do. Okay, money's a tool, money's a resource. Okay, and and if you look at it, not from necessarily from the money perspective, right? But look at it, what can you do with those resources, okay? I believe resources flow to people who have something good to do with those resources. So guys, welcome today, welcome, welcome. Super excited to have you here. Again, thank you, today is Thanksgiving and I'm super excited uh, to be with you here today. And if you haven't yet watched any of the other days leading up to today, day one, through 21, I encourage you to go back and binge watch, maybe go to YouTube and start with day one. Grab a notebook, grab a journal, grab a legal pad and take notes because there are nuggets, there's wisdom that I've shared up until this point every single day um, that I'm giving to you for free over the course of these 30 days and it's really been an honor, it's been a privilege, it's been exciting actually to prepare the night before. The way my rhythm looks is that I prepare the night before for you, then I wake up at about 4.50 or 4.51, uh, I have my alarm set for that time. I wake up at that time, sometimes I wake up a little earlier before the alarm goes off and then I prepare the next few hours uh, to getting into the right mental state, my morning rhythms that I've talked about before. Okay, I do the morning rhythms um, that get me uh, straight up here, get me in the right energetic state of body and mind, and then I rock it out with you here at 7 a.m. So guys, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for playing full out. Thank you for jumping in. Today, we have a lot to be grateful for, don't we? We have a lot to be grateful for. Well, you might be wondering, what the heck am I holding in my hands, right? Well, I gotta say, I'm holding this thing that's called Willy Wonka Golden Ticket. So I just got to tell you a little story um, that directly ties into the free golden ticket. So if, guys, if you haven't claimed your free golden ticket, go to freegoldenticket.com. Claim your free golden ticket while we still have supplies available. You don't want to miss out on this. You don't want to miss out on giving, getting a behind the scenes look at our seven figure expert, our seven and eight figure agency, and our seven figure e-commerce funnels, email scripts, and video tutorials to go along with this on this USB drive. And we ship it to you anywhere in the world. We have USBs right now in transit flying to Australia and New Zealand and the United Kingdom and Germany. We have these things flying all around the world. So don't worry, all you gotta do is pay the shipping and handling fee, $9.95, $9.95. It's about the cost of a Starbucks latte these days, right? And you'll get this in your hands again for free. So guys, make sure you get your hands on that free golden ticket while you still can. And if you know anyone who has a business who's an expert, maybe they're an author, speaker, coach, consultant, purpose-driven entrepreneur, they wanna leave a legacy, okay? They wanna con contribute their wisdom, their experience to the world so they can help others 
rise up, right? If you know anyone like that, feel free to share this video. Feel free to share the free golden ticket with them as well. Uh, share that funnel, okay? Just you know, tag them maybe in this video. Share this video with them. They'll, they'll, they'll see. Uh, or if, if you know any agencies, service providers, freelancers, okay, professionals that maybe build funnels or maybe have an advertising agency or a marketing company or design or branding, I don't know, anyone who has a service-based business that services others, our seven and eight figure funnels, emails, and scripts are loaded on that USB as well. And then some of my favorite e-commerce funnels, emails, and scripts are loaded onto those funnels, uh, the USB drive as well. So guys, claim your free golden ticket while you still have the opportunity to. And there are five of these winning tickets, okay? Five of these. These are $15,000 tickets because that's what clients pay to spend an entire day with my team and I in beautiful San Diego, California to map out the fastest path to, get, to making your dreams and your goals become a reality. That's what this day is all about. It's all about what are the funnels you need? What are the, what are the products that you need? What's your value net ladder need to look like? How are you gonna bring those funnels and those products to the market in the smartest way so you can spend money wisely and recoup that investment, break even, and then get on to profit mode all right so guys if you have any questions about that please drop a question below this video in the comment section whether you're here on facebook with me right now or later or you're on youtube watching this video later as well every video in this series goes up to youtube so other people can watch and binge watch later on okay so grab your free gold ticket guys now i want to tell you a little quick story about this little lottery ticket this little game you see over this summer i was home with the family every year we go to ocean city maryland it's a family tradition and we rent a big house and everybody stays together and it's a great time to connect it's a great time to be together we go out for crabs we go out on the water we go down to the beach we swim just a great time of just you know enjoying one another enjoying family having fun resetting uh, and relaxing and one of the last I think it was the last day or second to last day my dad came back from the grocery store or from getting gas and he saw one of these Willy Wonka tickets and the funny thing about that is that you know Willy Wonka was filmed a long time ago the original movie and then you had the one with Johnny Depp uh, but my dad spotted this and right at that time we hadn't yet launched the free golden ticket with you know, the whole theme of Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory, right? But we were in production. And my dad said, hey, you should go grab some tickets just for fun. So I went down, I bought $20 worth of tickets, okay? That's two tickets, okay? It's 10 bucks a ticket. I bought two tickets. I'm not a big gambler, to be honest with you. I believe in hard work. I believe in creating things of value for others and getting compensated based on that value. That's a personal belief. Um, I believe in creating my own money trees, as I like to say, um, and, and so I don't, I'm not a big gambler, okay? But this was kind of fun, and so I was like, you know what, let's do it. So I threw down 20, I got two tickets, I came back, I scratched them off, and I had won. The one was a dud, the other one I'd won, and I all, I'd won 10 bucks. So I was like, okay, well at least I recouped 50% of my investment, cool. So I went back and I said, you know what? What do I've got to hurt? Or what do I got, you know, what, what do I got to lose? 10 bucks? How about I trade this in, get my $10 back? And I was thinking, you know, I can call quits. You know, I can, I can take my loss. At least I made back that $10 and I can go on my way. But then I thought, you know what? What's another 10 bucks? Let me throw another 10 bucks in the kitty. So I threw another 10 bucks down and I pulled out one of these golden tickets and I actually won $50. And the clerk at the gas station who gave me this $50 bill, this is the exact $50 bill that they gave me. I thought it was cool. Um, so I kept it with this, and it's kind of like a symbol of, 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 you know, it's a memory for me, right? But it's cool, right? Like winning that 50 bucks, right? So I put $20 in. I got, initially got $10 back out. It's kind of like advertising, right? Put, put money in, you get money out. Well, I put that, that 10 bucks in, again, risked it all one more time, and pulled out $50. And at that point, I'm like, you know what? I'm done, I'm out. I don't need to try it anymore. 
I don't need to go big. I don't need to go any bigger because I'll take $20 in for $50 out all day long, right? I mean, what do you, how about you? What do you think? Would you have, how, how often would you like to take $20 in and pull $50 out? And guys, that's what we have the opportunity. I thought this is a good illustration of advertising. When we have the right funnels, when we have the right strategy, when we have the right value ladder, when we have the right products and services that serve our market, okay? It's very similar, okay? Quite often, we put in $20 and get $50 back. Many times, we put in $20 and get $100 back, okay? In some cases, we put in $20 and get $2,000 back. It just depends on the market, depends on the products and services that we're selling, depends on the value ladder, right? But I don't know about you, but I'm happy with putting $20 in and getting $50 back out, okay? That's, that's a great return on investment. Now, if you do what I'm about to talk to you about in this video today, the Stealth Bomber strategy, okay, you'll be able to do the same thing. Okay, but you gotta have the right strategy and you gotta understand what does it look like to run a seven and eight figure business, okay? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you up in the Stealth Bomber. I'm gonna take you up in a stealth bomber for a minute so you can look down and see what it really takes. Okay, let's get some perspective today. Now, let's jump into it. So here's the four buckets, okay, four buckets. You've got traffic, you've got funnels, you've got products, and you've got a main brand, okay? Now, in my opinion, in my experience of doing this for over a decade, you need all four of these, okay? Yeah. Can you get away with just having some funnels and some products? Sure. Products are also known as offers. So yeah, sure, you can just have a funnel and sell some offers. Great, okay? But I'm gonna show you why it's so important to have a main brand, a site that people can refer back to to see that you're credible. And there's a number of other reasons of why I like having these main brand sites, okay? Because it compounds everything else that we do. Okay, and then we have traffic, okay? So obviously once we build these things, we then have the ability to turn the traffic on and like I did with that lottery ticket, take $20 and pull $50 out, okay? If you do this right, you can do that predictably, okay? You can do that predictably, but it's really important. If you don't have the setup right, don't have the right offers for the right audience, then it's gonna be difficult. It's gonna be challenging for you, okay? And we don't want it to be challenging for you, right? We want it to be easy, as easy as possible. Now, this, okay, there's a lot going on here, okay? So I'm gonna speak it to you, I'm gonna share it with you. So number one is traffic, okay? Now I want you to write this down. You never, ever, 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 ever have a traffic problem. I could send you 100,000 emails, okay? I could send an email to my list of over 100,000 people right now, and I can send you a bunch of traffic. But the reality is, is that you don't have a traffic problem. You have a user experience and offer and message problem. What does that mean? You have a funnel and a message of the funnel and a product or offer problem right now. If you're not generating seven figures predictably, sustainably, and scalable, and, you know, and having it being scalable, then that's what your issue is. Okay, you don't have a traffic problem. guys. We can spend $5,000, $10,000, $30,000, $40,000 a day on Facebook ads. Okay, you don't ever have a traffic problem. Okay, same with YouTube, Instagram, okay? Affiliates are great, I love affiliates, okay? By the way, if you'd love to promote and share the free golden ticket and earn some commissions for, 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 for referring your friends, let me know, let me know. We have an affiliate program, we have a referral program for that. Email, you can buy emails. You can buy databases and have them send emails on your behalf. That works well as well if you buy the right list. Media buying, okay, if you wanna blow things up, you wanna get massive traffic, step into media buying. You can spend a ton of money every single day, but you gotta have the right offer for that strategy to work, okay? Remarketing, that's really a part of the overall traffic strategy that you should have in play. And LinkedIn, LinkedIn is great for some businesses. It's not good for everything because the cost per click on LinkedIn is pretty high. So you've gotta really have the value ladder to support it and it's more B2B, right? Like more business to business, more people that are on there that are professionals. 
you're not going to find consumer-based marketing working very well on LinkedIn. Okay, but you don't ever have a traffic problem. But traffic is a really important uh, part of your overall strategy. Without it, you're not going to make any sales. Okay, without it, you're not going to make any. You're not going to generate any leads, right? So traffic is important, but it's one of the buckets to the overarching strategy that you need to have in place, right? Okay, funnels. Okay, so I'm gonna give you an example of one of our um, high level, okay, stealth bomber, okay, strategies here, and that's a webinar funnel. I love webinars. Webinars are one of the greatest ways to build trust in a very short period of time and make an offer, okay? Love them, they're absolutely brilliant and been doing it for since 2010 and it just works like gangbusters. If you write your stories right, if it's compelling, if it's exciting, okay? Where I see most people fail with webinars is when they over teach and keep people stuck in the mud and that doesn't do anyone any good, now does it? Okay, the free golden ticket funnel, okay, that's a funnel. Right, freegoldenticket.com, that's a funnel. A trust funnel, okay, another example, okay? And then an application funnel, maybe an application for coaching or an application for mastermind or an application for a boot camp or something of, the, of that nature, right? So these are different examples, okay? Trust funnel might be a 21-day challenge or a 30-day challenge, I love challenges. We got some challenges coming up that I'm excited about. One of them is called the Lion Chaser Challenge. Oh, I'm so excited about that. Helping men step into their power and chase after the lion, that thing that's staring them at the face that they're scared of, the thing that's staring them at the face that that's big, hairy, and audacious, that vision that's big, hairy, and audacious, but it might be a little bit intimidating, which is rooted in a story of the Old Testament about a guy named Beniah who went into the pit with a lion on a snowy day and killed the lion. He saved that lion, but then he became one of David's mighty men. He was known as a man of valor, a mighty man. He rose up and, and because of that heroic deed of jumping into a pit, I don't know about you, but I'm not jumping into a pit with a lion any, any time soon. But he jumped into that pit, killed that lion, and he rose up and became a mighty man of valor, one of David's mighty men, top three most elite men. That's because he had the, the, will, the gumption the willingness to chase that line, that thing that was that was um, that was up that he was up against, and we're all up against a different lion. We all have different vision for our lives. So, anyways, that's something I'm excited about coming up. Okay, so these are your funnels, right? Then your products. I'll give you an example of, of some of our products, right? So, the free golden ticket for nine dollars and ninety-five cents. It's free. Just got to pay the shipping cost, so we can send it all the way around the world, right? Everlasting funnel checklist for thirty-seven dollars. Okay, a checklist. Okay, before you launch any funnel, run through the checklist before you launch that funnel. Okay, to make sure everything's checked off, right? That's an important thing to have. Every SOP or standard operating procedure has a checklist, right? You need to know, make sure you dot your I's and cross your T's. That's what that's for. The seven figure advertising playbook. That's how we've scaled advertising from just $10 a day to over $5,000 a day profitably. There's not a lot of people that actually can scale from five to 5,000 or 10 to 5,000 profitably. Okay, there's a way we, di we did it and there was a way that we do it. And in the playbook, I reveal that strategy. Okay, 60 minute strategy session with me for 197. Okay, a 30 minute strategy call with one of my coaches for 97 and then a one day private intensive. I've mentioned those. Okay, people pay anywhere from 10 to $15,000 to spend an entire day with my team and I in beautiful San Diego, California and map out the fastest path to seven figures a year or seven figures a month. And remember, when you claim your free golden ticket, guys, there's five lucky winners who get to spend that entire day with my team and I here in beautiful La Jolla, California, San Diego, to map out the fastest path to your seven figure business, okay? And I'd love that for you to be one of them, okay? And again, if you know anyone that would benefit from having a USB, be sure to share it with them, okay? And lastly is the main brand, okay? The main brand is like your main site, okay? If you go to apple.com, that's an example, right? Um, but this is your main site, this is your main brand. It says, tells about you and your, and, and your business, has testimonials for so, and social proof built in, a blog, lists the funnels, lists the products, 
the contact page, the legal pages in the footer, right? How it works, right? All of these different things, okay? Now, these are important, okay? People validate their decisions about buying your products and services by looking at reviews if they go on Amazon, right? Like, I don't buy stuff on Amazon unless it has a lot of reviews, okay? People like to validate their decision to make that investment. Okay, so a lot of times people will refer back to the main brand. Also, the most important thing about the main brand is that it's the content engine, okay? It's the thing that's driving the boat. Back in 2010, I had just come back from Aspen, Colorado, and I was um, creating, uh, I was figuring out, you know, I wanted to do things a little differently. I wanted to get out of just doing affiliate marketing. I wanted to actually create my own products and services that I could sell um, in an automated way. And one of the, th the, the promptings that I got was to start blogging. And I'm like, I got the prompting, I got the urge. You know when the urge comes, right? The prompting comes, feel a nice kick to do something, right? And so I started blogging. And within two weeks of blogging, I had someone contact me and they ended up writing me a check for $60,000 to help them build a lead generation system for their network marketing company. And about 16 different people in this round robin uh, lead generation system and it was awesome, right? Come to find out, I said, how did you hear about me? It wasn't from referrals, it wasn't from paid ads because I wasn't even spending any money on advertising at that time. I wasn't spending a dime. I said, how did you hear about me? And I was expecting it to be a referral and he said, I happened to stumble upon your blog. I was reading your content, I thought it was amazing and I knew you were the guy that I needed to hire to help me build my funnels and create this lead generation system for my business and for our reps. And lo and behold, cut me a $60,000 check for helping him to build that asset for his business and for his distributors, the people that are involved in that lead generation asset, okay? So don't dismiss this main site, okay? Don't let anyone tell you that this is not valuable. Okay, this is extremely valuable and it's a part of the whole puzzle, okay? Yeah, you can have a funnel, okay? But that funnel is not something that you can add content to that's gonna rank in the search engines that's gonna allow you to get free traffic. I don't know about you, but I like free traffic, okay? I love paid traffic because I can turn on the, the, the spigot whenever I want, but more than paid traffic, I love free traffic. I love people searching for for, uh, for stuff online and they find me. I love people searching for things on YouTube and they find me, like there is nothing better than free traffic. Give me an amen for that, right? Um, so that's part of the overall strategy, guys. So I hope you understand. These four buckets are essential for you to get into the Two Comma Club Award, earn seven figures a year in your business. You gotta have the right traffic sources for the right audience, of course. But you gotta have the right funnels for that audience as well. Okay, in the market that you're serving. Then you gotta serve up the right products. One of the biggest things I see people doing is not having enough products in their value ladder. So you wanna think through that strategically. If you need some help thinking through it, I'd be happy to do that. That's what we do in our 60 minute strategy session. I help you think through the value ladder for your, for your business. So that way, when you launch that funnel, you have the path to take them on. You have the path to be able to monetize it so you can spend money to acquire customers, okay? Remember, he who has, or he who can spend the most to acquire customer wins, right? Okay, you wanna be that person. You wanna be the man or woman who has the money, the resources to acquire customers. And then fourth, having a main brand, having a main site, having a place that you can constantly update with fresh, new, relevant information, and you can bring thought leadership to the world, okay? That's what we use the blog for, okay? We use it as a content engine. Now, of course, we're gonna have testimonials. We're gonna link to, we're gonna link to the funnels and send them out into the funnels. We're gonna link, we're gonna showcase products, okay? And put them at our retail prices, okay? We're gonna have a way to contact us. We're gonna show that we're legitimate 
have a phone number, like maybe a live chat. I like to do that, as you know, from previous days. Again, guys, if you haven't watched some of the previous days, I'd really recommend and encourage you to go back and binge watch from day one to 21 because I'm stacking, I'm stacking. Okay, so there's some stuff that I've talked about that I know I've talked about and that I'm also <laughs> revealing and sharing, like what's a value ladder, what's stacking, like that kind of thing that I know we've talked about, but you might not have heard it yet. Okay, so be sure to go back and binge watch. Go to YouTube, search for Brian Delaney. You'll find my channel. Be sure to subscribe and then watch video one through 21 and just start going through it. Today's a great day for that, right? We've got time off, time with friends, time with family, okay? Or just time to relax a little, right? I'm looking forward to that myself, hitting the gym up here after this Facebook Live video and then relaxing, resting, and spending time with Stephanie and, and um, everything that we have in store for today, which is gonna be exciting. Okay, now, let's jump into some questions, all right? And again, for those of you that are joining me, okay, thank you for being here. Thank you for being here. If you know anyone that would benefit from hearing what I shared today, okay, be sure to share this video or be sure to comment and tag someone in this video. And guys, claim your free golden ticket while they last, okay? Don't miss out. You don't want to miss out on our seven-figure and eight-figure expert agency and e-commerce funnels, emails and scripts plus video training to break down and just and, and, and share with you what each thing is, okay? There's over 30 videos that we have prepared for you, okay, to go through and understand what it takes to build a seven and eight figure business and the funnels, the emails and scripts that you'll need when you're building it for yourself or when you get the help and hire a team of experts like my team and I, and we would love to be uh, on the journey with you to helping you bust through that invisible income ceiling so you can earn that seven figures, get into the Two Comma Club Award, and eventually get yourself into that Eight Figure Club Award as well, okay? Now, I, I got this question, okay? Funnel first or main brand? Brian, should I build my main brand site or should I build my funnel? Okay, first off, before you build either one, make sure you have the right strategy, make sure you're building the right funnel, make sure you're selling the right products and services, you have the right offer, but I would say, you wanna build your brand before you build your funnels, right? So get your logo, get your style guide, your mood board, your typography. How does all that apply, okay? If I would've done it differently in reverse time, I would've set things up differently. I would've got the right strategy. I would've hired the right expert to, to help me create the game plan so that I could run after that game plan and create a roadmap of success and then created the right brand that I could live within and apply to everything that I was doing. Okay, so that's what I would recommend there. I wanna build a massive, uh, I wanna, what to build the main site with? Okay, yeah, this is a great question. So people say, should I use ClickFunnels to build my main site? Uh, what else, what should I use? Should I use WordPress? And I do not recommend ClickFunnels for your main site. Okay, personally, I don't recommend it because your main site serves as your content engine. Okay, you don't wanna be constantly updating multiple funnel pages to add content to your site. Okay, it's silly. WordPress is built, okay, to allow you to easily add posts and pages, and there's a lot of amazing themes that are out there. Okay, there's a lot of amazing themes that are out there that you can build your main site in, and then you can just add blog posts, add posts constantly and frequently as fast as you can produce that content, okay? Best membership platform? I get this question a lot as well. Brian, what should I use for my membership? Is ClickFunnels okay to build a membership in? Sure, ClickFunnels is great. I love ClickFunnels, as you know. I primarily love ClickFunnels for the funnels, okay? The sales funnels, okay? The lead generation funnels. But I prefer Thinkific as number one for my membership site, followed up by Kajabi then click funnels okay that's the order that i personally prefer it in um, you can get custom build your own custom wordpress site with wishlist and mambarium but that's a little complicated there's no need for all that nonsense okay we've done that before it's just a lot of time energy and effort okay to create it i recommend thinkific 
or Kajabi. They're great, they're easy to use, great user experience. You can do quizzes, certificates of completion. I love that about um, Thinkific. I can create, I can gamify it. Okay, gamify the experience for the membership site. It's amazing. And then Kajabi, uh, then ClickFunnels falls in third place, in my opinion. Okay, when I'm building membership sites, I'm not using it because it's not strong there. It's not, they need to work on that a little more. Okay, they need to upgrade that a little more. They need to put a little more attention into that, which I believe they are. But if you're asking my opinion, as of November 22nd, 2018, that's the order. Thinkific, Kajabi, and then ClickFunnels, okay? Free funnel or paid or buyer funnel? Brian, I get this question. Brian, should I focus on a, a free funnel to generate leads or should I build a paid funnel like free plus shipping or a low ticket, maybe 27, 37, 47, that kind of thing? Well, guess what? I'm gonna say both. And the reason why I'm gonna say both is because they serve two different purposes, okay? Number one, a buyer is 40 times more valuable than a lead, okay, according to cash advertising. It's a book, I recommended it before. I'm, I'll recommend it again, cash advertising, okay? 40 times more, okay? That's pretty powerful. I would rather have buyers than leads, but if it was up to me, I'd have both, okay? So I don't want, you shouldn't be thinking about either or, but think about both. I wanna be building a list of leads and I wanna be building a list of buyers. I wanna be doing both. I don't wanna be doing one or the other. I wanna do both, right? And some people are just not yet ready, right? To spend money, pull out the credit card, make an investment. Other people are ready. They're ready to go. Boom, they're in. Other people, they're not yet ready, okay? All right. So some insights from today, guys. And I hope you're enjoying uh, these free Eight Figure Club Coaching and ClickFunnels support videos that I've been doing over the last 22 days. I'm excited for the next coming upcoming days, day 23 through day 30. I'm excited about those. Thank you for playing full out. Thank you for commenting. Thank you for being here, showing up. And happy Thanksgiving, by the way. Happy Thanksgiving for those of you who are just tuning in. There's a lot to be grateful for. I, I certainly have a lot to be grateful for today. And maybe you create a list of the top 10 things or 20 things or 30 things. See how far you can go with it. The top 10 things that you're grateful for. Who are you grateful for? What are you grateful for? It's a ritual, it's a practice that I would recommend making and turning into a morning rhythm. Something you think about right when you get out of bed. What am I grateful for? For me, I started off by saying, you know, Lord, thank you for this amazing day. Thank you for the eyes I have to see and the ears I have to hear. And I start at that level. I start at a physical level, very simple, like things that we take for granted sometimes that we have the ability to see and we have the ability to speak and we have the ability to feel and we have the ability to hear. Those are blessings. Those are things that we have in our lives that are, that just come for free, but we just sometimes take them for granted. So I encourage you today, Thanksgiving Day, to make a list of the things that you're grateful for and then reach out to people that you're grateful for. Okay, send them a little letter, send them a little note. You know, they'll be encouraged by it and you'll be encouraged by it as well. Okay, so insights, your value ladder matters. Okay, you gotta think through it. You gotta build the right value ladder. Okay, the right number of offers and services from free to paid, from low ticket to high ticket. You wanna be thinking through those and you want to be mindful of your value ladder because, because you know the saying, he who can spend the most to acquire a customer wins, okay? Traffic is never a problem. It's your offers and then your funnels, okay? okay? You don't have a funnel problem until you have created your offer. You don't have a traffic problem until you've created your funnels and your offers, okay? It's in that order. You create your offers then you create your funnel, then you create traffic, right? Then you turn on traffic, Facebook ads, Instagram, YouTube, right? So you never, ever, ever, never, ever, ever have a traffic problem. You only always ever have first an offer problem, an offer and message to the market problem, followed by a funnel problem, okay? Followed by traffic. And I see this getting messed up all the time. A lot of people think, you know, I need to start a podcast, Brian, because I need to get traffic. 
But then I'm like, okay, for example, I was at FedEx the other night. I was dropping off a package and I was wearing a ClickFunnels shirt. And the guy behind the desk goes, you're just one funnel away. I'm like, how do you know that? You know, how do you know that saying? And he had been following ClickFunnels and he'd read uh, Expert Secrets. And so he was a little bit, he was in the know a little bit. And so I asked him what he did and what he sells. And he's like, oh, I'm, I've started a YouTube channel. I've been doing YouTube videos. and. Um, but I'm not getting any traction. I said, well, what are you selling? He's like, well, I don't have anything to sell yet. I'm like, huh, well, that's interesting. Okay, cart before the horse kind of situation, right? So first, we want to think through what is it that we're going to offer the world that's of value, that they get value from, that they love, that they enjoy, that they can't live without. Okay, once we dial that in, okay, this is how it works, guys. You dial in your offer, you create your products and services, then you worry about your funnel. That's the next layer. Okay, how can I create a funnel to sell the things that I'm going to sell that I that I need to, that I want to offer to the world? Then you worry about the funnel. You don't worry about the funnel before the offer. You don't worry about traffic before the offer or the funnel either. Okay, so it comes offer, then worry about the funnel, the way in which you're going to take people through a process. Okay, of developing relationships, building trust, and making sales. Then you can worry about traffic. Okay, and again. You don't ever have a traffic problem. I can send an email to my list of over 100,000 people and I can give you traffic, okay? But if you don't have the right offer, the right message, and the right funnel, all of that's gonna be a waste. It's just gonna be a waste, right? Might as well just send them to google.com so they can search for something, right? Okay, your main site validates and is a content engine. I want you to look at your main site Okay, your main brand site, whether it's you personally or you have a brand name for it. Okay. Bulletproof Coffee is an example. Okay. Go to Bulletproof Coffee, they say coffee. Okay. But then Dave Asprey has funnels. Okay. He's got he sells his book, he sells these other things, he brings his thought leadership to the world. Okay, but your main site is not just a place to list products and services. It's meant to be living and breathing. That's why we add live chat. We add the phone number in some cases. Okay, we wanna bring that puppy to life, right? And we wanna post on it and build up our assets, right? I want you to think about content as assets. Every, every time you release content into the world, you are dropping an asset, okay? You're putting up and building up an asset. That's the way I view it. That's why I would encourage you to view it. How many assets have you created? Dr. Axe is a beautiful example of this. DrAxe.com. If you haven't seen DrAxe.com, you should go. The guy gets over a million visitors a month for free to his website. A million, a million visitors a month for free is a pretty nice position to be in. You see, not a lot of people are talking about getting free traffic, ranking in the search engines, but it's a very powerful strategy if you know what you're doing. Okay, I started in the game of search engine optimization. I started with SEO. That's how I learned. And then I got really, really good at it. And it was amazing. Free traffic when you're in college, you don't have any money, you don't have, you don't have the money to rub together. In college, I didn't have it. I was borrowing money on student loans. I didn't have the extra money to run around, so I had to figure it out for free. And then I realized that I don't have any control over that free traffic realize you know I need to learn how to do pay traffic too. Okay. And blogging and producing content can make you wealthy. Like if that's a big takeaway from today, I really want you to take that with you into today and into the weeks ahead. Once you have your offers, once you have your funnels, then you can start thinking about traffic and creating the content, maybe it's a podcast, YouTube channel, Okay, maybe it's Facebook Lives, but then you can start pummeling the internet with value first, okay, and then make offers. Okay, value first, and then make offers. Trust is dead in the economy that we live in today because of what happened in 2005, 6, 7, and really what happened in 2008. Trust went down the tubes, especially in America. So we've got to do things to, to provide value, to build trust, okay, deliver results in advance, 
and then we can make offers. Then it's okay, then it's cool, right? But when you meet someone for the first time, pitching them on your products and services feels like you're at a real estate networking event, right? With a bunch of realtors and brokers that are trying to just get the next business, your next, the, next, the next sale. Right? We don't want to be, we don't want to come off that way. We don't want to feel that way at all, right? Okay, so thank you guys for tuning in to today. That's a wrap, okay? So today in the Stealth Bomber strategy of our free eight-figure club coaching and click funnel support, I hope that you got some massive value, some big takeaways from today, and I hope that you got some of your ans questions answers. Continue to send us your questions, whatever questions come up for you over the 30 days or Questions that aren't even related, okay? Feel free to ask, okay? Any topic about marketing, about advertising, about, about um, creating products and services, building winning offers, creating winning offers. Shoot, you can ask me any question on any of the topics in the description of this video. In the description of this video, I have a list of all types of topics, okay? Feel free to pick one. Feel free to ask me a question. And thank you for those of you who are asking, who are engaging, who are playing full out, Thank you for being here. I'm excited to help you break that invisible income ceiling and blow past the two comma club award and get into the eight figures, okay? Get into that eight figure club. So thank you guys for being here. Thank you, thank you. Have an amazing and blessed and grateful Thanksgiving day with your friends and your family or whoever it is that is in your life that you love. Have an amazing day today and I'll see you back here tomorrow, bright and early, 7.30 a.m. California time zone and guys if you haven't claimed your free golden ticket or you know someone that hasn't yet claimed a free golden ticket and could use the insight and the wisdom of building seven figure and eight figure funnels emails and scripts okay then feel free to share it with them or grab your free golden ticket now while supplies last and while there's still an opportunity to get one of these five winning tickets to spend an entire day with my team and I in beautiful San Diego California here in our offices in La Jolla. Thank you so much for tuning in, and again, have a blessed day, and I'll see you back here tomorrow morning.